Okay, so guys, I was telling you that I'm just overjoyed about the goodness of the Lord. And I want us to share the book of Psalm 107. And it says, Give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. His love endures forever. Let the redeemed of the Lord tell their story. Those he redeemed from the land of the foe. Those he gathered from the lands from east and west, from north and south. Some wandered in desert wastelands, finding no way to a city where they could settle. They were hungry and thirsty, and their lives ebbed away. Then they cried out to the Lord in their trouble, and he delivered them from their distress. He led them by a straight way to a city where they would settle. Let them give thanks to the Lord for his unfailing love and his wonderful deeds for mankind. For he satisfies the thirsty and fills the hungry with good things. Some sat in darkness in utter darkness, prisoners suffering in iron chains because they rebelled against God's commands and despised the plans of the Most High. So he subjected them to bitter labor. Um, to bitter labor. They stumbled and there was no one to help. Then they cried to, their, to the Lord in their trouble and he saved them from their distress. He brought them out of the darkness, the utter darkness, and broke away their chains. Let them give thanks to the Lord for his unfailing love and his wonderful deeds for mankind. For he breaks down gates of bronze and cuts through bars of iron. Some became fools some became fools through their rebellious ways and suffered affliction because of their iniquities. They loathed all food and drew near the gates of death. Then they cried to the Lord in their trouble and he saved them from their distress. He sent out his word and healed them. He rescued them from the grave. Let them give thanks to the Lord for his unfailing love and his wonderful deeds for mankind. Let them sacrifice, thank offerings, and tell of his works with songs of joy. Some went out on the sea with ships. They were merchants of the mighty waters. They saw the works of the Lord his wonderful deeds in depths. In deep, sorry. For he spoke and stirred up a tempest, then lifted high the waves. They mounted up the heavens and went down to the depths. In their peril, their courage melted away. They reeled and staggered like drunkards. They were at their wits' end. Then they cried out to the Lord in their trouble, and he brought them out of their distress. Amen. Verse 29. He stilled the storm to a whisper. The waves of the sea were hushed. They were glad when it grew calm, and he guided them to their desired haven. Let them give thanks to the Lord for his unfailing love and his wonderful deeds for mankind. Let them exalt him in the assembly of the people and praise him in the council of the elders. He turned rivers into a desert, flowing springs into thirsty ground, and fruitful land into a salt waste because of the wickedness of those who lived there.
He turned the desert into pools of water and the parched ground into flowing springs. There he brought the hungry to live and they founded a city where they could settle. Amen. They sowed fields and planted vineyards that yielded a fruitful harvest. He blessed them and their numbers greatly increased and he did not let their hearts diminish. Then their numbers decreased and they were humbled by oppression, calamity and sorrow. He who pours contempt on nobles made them wander in a trackless waste. Verse 41, but he lifted the needy out of their affliction and increased their families like flocks. Amen. The upright see and rejoice, but all the wicked shut their mouths. Let the one who is wise heed these things and ponder the loving deeds of the Lord. Amen. Oh, that men would praise the Lord. Oh, that men would praise the Lord for his goodness and for his wonderful love to the children of men. He has broken the gates of brass and turned the bars of iron asunder. He has broken the gates of brass and cut the bars of iron asunder. If you hear me sing this, I have a testimony that he has broken the gates of brass and he has cut the bars of iron asunder. May we praise the Lord. May the redeemed of the Lord say so. Let the redeemed of the Lord say so. Let the redeemed of the Lord say so. Let the redeemed of the Lord say so. I'm redeemed, I'm redeemed, says the Lord. Amen.